So let's find out. So let's get to the bottom of this. Saying? Yeah, let's ask about the children of Adam. What's the deal with the children of Adam? They're religious folk. Worship the power of Adam, which is radiation, I guess. If you want details, you'd have to find and ask them. We used to have a peace with them until a certain hothead menace named Alan Lee. Uh oh. Now that's enough. That preacher came into the harbor saying that it was Adam's will that we lost our land. That it was Adam's goddamn will that we lost so many friends and family. And that the Adam would wipe this whole place clean of us. Huh. If it were up to me, you'd hang for what you did to that preacher, Alan. Whoa. So a preacher came into town and he, f he killed it. What did he do to the preacher? Alan pulled a gun on him. He claims the preacher reached for his. We don't have police, or really any law. Just custom and popular sentiment. And after everything the preacher said, it was abundantly clear doing anything to Alan would have made matters worse. Hmm. Okay. Have the children made the fog worse? Absolutely not. There's not one bit of evidence. Geiger counters don't lie, Avery. The fog's gotten more lethal year over year. And now the fog's covering the whole island. But only after the children came. You know as well as I do, that's happened before. Sure, people have theories the children are involved, but no one, and I mean no one, has proof. Hmm. Okay. Can we get back to business? Sorry for all that. You're here for Kasumi, right? <clears throat> she headed inland to the Synth Refuge, Acadia. Getting there will be dangerous. You'll need a guide. Old Longfellow. No one knows the fog like him. But uh, word of warning, he's a bit of an acquired taste. Okay, Longfellow. This old Longfellow's story. He's the best hunter on the island. Fearless. <laughs> Some say crazy. <laughs> if someone needs to get to Acadia, he's the only one that'll do it. But uh, people around here are known for being stubborn, willful, and other less flattering things. But Longfellow's got a reputation even among us. Okay, let's ask about Acadia. What can you tell me about Acadia? Ask Longfellow. He's the only one that's been there. Okay. Thanks for the info. Best place to look for Longfellow's at the bar. The last plank. And, uh, please, lend a hand around town if you're able. Even if it's slapped away, people like the Mariner and Cassie and others need help. And let me say something you might not hear again. Thank you. <laughs> so I guess she's the nicest person in town, huh? Damn, there's a lot to do. Look, talk to old Longfellow, but there's other missions too. Well, let's look around. Living on the edge! Who's this, Cassie? Oh, it's the Mariner. Let's talk to the Mariner. Hello, the Mariner. I'm trying Mariner. to talk to you. The hull took a battery. To be sure. She wouldn't be standing at all. It would for you. They call me the Mariner. Shipwright. Handyman. The only one keeping the harbor afloat. Beside Captain. She talks about the harbor like it's a ship. That's kind of weird. A pleasure to meet you. Likewise. I hope the island doesn't kill you quick. Or slow, for that matter. I don't suppose you'd be willing to lend a hand. In order to do proper repairs, I need tools. Specialized tools. And they won't be easy to come by. 450 caps if you can, though. What is a collection quest? So I'd be risking my life for only 450 caps. <laughs> I'm a bit short. On More caps. caps. But I have old Jimmy's shotgun. I can give you a shotgun. Heavens no. He can't use it anymore. I guess he's dead. All right. You've kept the walls together this long. Why do you need special tools now? I want to build the hull up proper, make it strong, and keep those blasted crabs out. Crabs, huh? Mutated crabs. Sign me up. I'll help. Eagle's Cove Tannery. Tools are certain to be there. Now get. All right, she gave me a mission. Whole breach. Get the power tools. Okay. More people over here. I'm assuming that's the bar. What's this here? Is Cassie? You're that mainlander who just got here. Better watch yourself. Because this island sees and hears everything you do. Uh, I should know. I watched the island tear down the greatest family that ever set foot in Far Harbor. 
It's a tale of green lies. A tale of which to ignore. Okay. <laughs> I guess she says the island hears and sees everything you do. What is this fucking lost? What family are you talking about? I was just about to explain. My family, the Daltons, was the pride of Far Harbor for generations. Even back before the war, it was lumber and fishing that made the Daltons rich. But they got greedy, took too much from the island. The island's been getting revenge ever since. Jesus, this thing makes so much noise. You hear it? Fuck. I'm the last Dalton still standing. I'd like to understand ah, hear you, but I can't. It's too loud right here. Now our story <laughs> takes an unexpected turn. A mysterious stranger comes to Far Harbor. Someone strong. Someone capable. With the stranger's help, the last living Dalton finally has a chance to avenge her bloodline once and for all. What? I can't hear you. I hear creaking and squeaking. Wait. Are you saying that I'm the mysterious stranger who's gonna help you avenge your family? Ah, you're a quick one. Good. You'll need your wits about you, because your part in the story is filled with danger. Now, on to the first chapter in our tale of vengeance. That would be the sad story of Freckle Faced Pete. Freckle Faced Pete. Pete. My cousin. He was a good lad, never caused trouble. He thought all those freckles brought him luck, but... <laughs> what? Well, but he was so ugly as sin. He just didn't know it. He was foraging at the National Park campground when the island sick some feral ghouls on him. Ouch. The island's a sneaky bastard when it wants to be. Anyway, he made it back to town, but died from his injuries that night. Of course, those ferals are still out there, waiting to kill the next poor fool who comes along. Damn, shame. Okay, I think she wants me to kill the ghouls. Where did you say these ghouls were? National Park Campground. It's pretty much straight west of here. Okay. Those ghouls are as good as dead. Good, good. It's long past time those shamblers paid for what they did to Pete. Blood Tide! Eliminate the feral ghouls. If you know what? This guy's giving me the fucking stink eye. What are you looking at, asshole? Get the fuck out of here. Look at this guy. Stop looking at me like that. With your little fucking douchey ponytail. It's fucking Geralt from The Witcher 3. Dick. Fuck out of here, Harper man. Let's look at the map. We haven't looked at the map yet. Whoa, it's a totally new map. Look at this. Totally new. Wow, this is huge. we got here? We've got National Park Campground and the Eagle's Cove Tannery. Those are where the two missions are. The Commonwealth is to the east. And we're gonna talk to Old Longfellow. Alright, let's talk to Old Longfellow and then maybe we'll do some of these missions. What the hell is this? Eww. They're boiling a crab for dinner, I guess. Shot. If you need any odds and ends, I'm your man. What if he has ammo? What's your story? What's your story? Just a guy trying to make a few caps. Speaking of which, buying anything? Let's see if he has ammo. Of course. He has ammo. How much money do I have? Four thousand caps. Uh, all right. What kind of ammo do I need? Forty-five rounds. I need. And I need probably all electricity ammo, electric style, right? If he has any. He doesn't, I don't think. All I really need are the 45 rounds. That's for the, uh, the overseer's rifle, I believe. Bobby pins, don't need those. A desk fan. Fusion cells. Those aren't for, those aren't ammo, are they? No, that's for the the suit, I believe. Yeah, I got plenty of fusion cells. Gamma rounds. I probably want some gamma rounds. Uh, 
The hard harpoons. And a harpoon gun. Look, a new weapon. The harpoon gun and a harpoons. Huh. Wonder if it's any good. You know what? I'm gonna buy it. Just for the hell of it. Just to have it since it's a new weapon. The Longshoreman's Outfit. The Marksman's Boosted Fiery Improved Automatic Plasma Rifle. <laughs> Could it be any more complicated? Mmm, some Mirelurk Jerky. Fisherman's Hat. Plasma cartridges. I'll always take plasma ammo. Uh, anything else? Oh, Railway Spikes. He has 12 Railway Spikes. The Recon Marine's Helmet. Oh my god! 10,000! What the fuck? A revolutionary sword? Nah, I don't use melee combat, so... Okay, shipments of resources. Shotgun shells I'm good on, so I'm not gonna bother with that. Anything else? No, I guess not. Well, 2,000 caps, but I got the harpoon gun. Let's take a look at the harpoon gun. Brand new weapon. Look at this thing. Oh my god. Jesus. Look at this fucking Mariner thing. Says the fog is alive. I'm gonna use that. <laughs> Nick's like, what the fuck, man? Put the gun down. Who's this? Teddy Wright. Hey there. You another vulture circling over Andre's body? He ain't dead. Who the fuck is Andre? It's a mainland. Welcome to my little clinic. Who is this if guy? If doctoring, speak up. I, I wish I had time for some proper conversation, but my work's never done. Who's Andre? Who's Andre? Poor Andre is my patient over there. He spent too long a spell in the fog. Huh. You may think you know your mainland radiation poisoning, but you got own special brand here. Can I help him? I know a few things about medicine. Can I try to help him? You say, what? You? Help? Well, poor Andre's got it bad. Good as dead. Well, I suppose there's no harm letting you have a poke. But I'll be watching you. Where is he? This is him, huh? Andre Michaud. Let's take a look. Mm. Mm. Here you go. Andre Michaud is suffering from prolonged severe radiation exposure. He's barely cleaning the life. Impro improvise a treatment or use a mysterious serum. What, mysterious serum? I had that from the other game. Yeah, I had this. Let's improvise a treatment. Using blood plasma, right away, and anesthetics, you managed to stabilize your patient. I think you may have done. Huh. I'll keep looking after Andre. But I think thanks to you, he's got a fighting chance. So did that... Maybe that helped out. Andre. John. No. No. John. Huh. Is this a social visit or is something alien? Yeah, I need a doctor. Then speak up. I'm listening. He can uh, cure me. Cure addiction, yeah. I think I took something. Too much of something. Do you have anything for addiction? Take a deep breath. This may be some rough going. Good, I'll get rid of the stupid chem addiction I had. You shoved that right up my ass. <laughs> and that's that. Anything else bothering you? No, I'm good with everything else, I believe. Actually, it's nothing. For what? Oh, you're leaving. Okay. Well, I did a side mission here randomly with this Andre. I cured him. Maybe later on a mission will open up because of it or something. I don't know. Psst. Looking for a bargain? Let's trade. Happily. You said he had a fisherman's hat? Let us look at his hats. Maybe we can get a different hat than the one I'm wearing. Chef's hat now. I've had that before. I had the chef's hat before. Fisherman's overalls. Didn't have the fisherman's hat. There was a hat, I thought. Old fisherman's hat. I bought it. So, uh, apparel. The old fisherman's hat. 
This will give you bonus perception and some damage resistance. There we go. I'm wearing a hat. I look like an idiot in cutscenes. Alright, we also gotta talk to what's his name. Alright, to the last plank. And then we're off to do some missions, I guess. See what we run into in this DLC. There he is. What else is going on in this bar? It's another d a guy who looks kind of like Everyone. Geralt, only he's a redhead. A ginger. Mitch? What the fuck? Shut your mouths. Open your damned ears. So the fogs are coming for us all. I can't see any better way of greeting it than to have another round. <laughs> On the how? What the hell? Yeah. Is he giving out free drinks? The party. Here's some Mitch. Mitch. Mainlander, today's your lucky day. What's going on here? For you. <laughs> Something stronger? You have anything a bit stronger? <laughs> Pushing your luck, are ya? Ha! I like it. Take this. Top shelf all around. What's with this guy? Just so, give him free shit out. You stay here over long and the fog will claim you. Might as well meet her with a belly full of fire, eh? The fog? What's so special about the fog on the island? Can you feel it? Even here, as safe as anyone can be on this damned island. It's alive. You walk inland. Kick you up in no time. And if the clickety click of the Geiger don't get you, the madness will. The island will claim us all in the end. He's nuts. The fog can drive you crazy? <laughs> yes. It's not natural. The trappers you find inland, some were always murderous louts. But many just got lost in the fog for too long. And Mine goes. If you have any sense, return where you came from. And don't look back. Why did you stay? If it's so dangerous, why do you stay? This hmm. is our home. If you call yourself a proper man or woman, you don't give up on that. Besides, we all gotta die. Might as well do it with your long knife deep in the belly of the beast that wronged you. Ha! Okay. I guess I should rent a room, right? That way I'll have a place to store stuff and sleep. Yeah. I'd like to rent a room. I just noticed my hat. <laughs> Alright, I rented a room here. That's good. Okay. So that's the guy I'm supposed to talk to. Is there anyone else in here to talk to? Oh, Debbie? Anything likes you. Here, kitty. What the hell? <clears throat> I hope mainlanders did better than my regulars. What you need? Oh, she's the waitress. What do you have to drink? All sorts of old world booze. We carry Vim, too. And before you ask, Vim is an Islander favorite. Ah. But it may pack more punch than the stuff you're used to. The local brew. No thanks. Well, maybe later then. She's the bartender. We I mean, she washed her fucking face once a century, though. The hell's all over. It's just a generic guy, the harbor man. Let's go see our room before we talk to this guy. Is this our room? Nope. Aha! Here? Ah, nice! I guess we should get in a good night's rest before we start off with, uh... With our, our questing, right? It's 10 a.m. Oh, time to sleep! Let's sleep at 8 hours from 10 a.m. <laughs> he goes to sleep at 10 in the morning. I worked a night shift. Very nice. Alright. So that worked. Now let's talk to this guy. Old Longfellow. Captain Avery said you can get me to Acadia. Oh shit. You get your hands dirty? <laughs> I'm done leading people to their deaths in the fog. Last fella couldn't keep up. Look. Hell yeah. Look what I found. The Islander's Almanac. You've unlocked 
Point of interest map markers across the island. Nice. All right, let's talk to him about Acadia. Can you tell me about Acadia? Strange folk like that. Call themselves synths. Seems to me they just want to be left alone. Live their life in peace. My harpoon goes They've fusing with his shoulder. Turns, <laughs> the fog condensers, most especially, wouldn't even be a far harbor left without those. Fog condensers? What's a fog condenser? The condensers? They're a tricky bit of science. They keep the fog away. That's what those light things are. Powered by the wind farm, the synth fellows got up and running. Ah. Us islanders don't particularly like being obligated to them. But there you have it. Okay. Let's bribe his ass. Yeah, let's look, I tell him we're looking for a runaway. Some parents are worried <clears throat> about their runaway daughter. She went to Acadia, and I need to find her. If someone's headed for Acadia, there's always a story. Yours worth dying over, huh? I don't know, you want a harpoon to the fucking face? You should give a damn! This girl's all her family has. <laughs> You'd have to be a real wretch not to give a damn. Bah! Ha! It goes against all reason. But I can get you to Acadia. But you've got to listen to me. Go where I say, when I say it. Still won't be easy. You stock up on your necessities, Rad X and the like. I think I got a ton. In real world. Can begin. Hey, any other preparations? Should I make any other preparations? Ammo, stim packs, maybe a rocket or three. <laughs> Worse than my alerts. Oh, I just bought ammo. I'm good. Yeah, I just bought all that 45 ammo, so that's going to be good for the overseer's rifle. I should be fine. <clears throat> Let's go, Longfellow. Follow me. All right, we're off. Let's see where he leads us. Let's freak a harpoon gun. <laughs> Let's take a look. At what are the point of interest that I opened up on the map? Let's look. We've got Cliff's Edge Hotel. Oh, wow. The Oceanarium. Eden Meadow Cinemas. Echo Lake Lumber. Oh, oh, wow. There's a lot. What's this? The Rayburn Point. Brookshead Lighthouse. Cranberry Island Bog. Southwest Harbor, an old pond house, and the MS uh, Az Azalea. I guess it's a ship. The Azalea. All right, let's go. Let's follow the old, follow the old fart. Oh no! Sunshine Tidings is under attack. What the fuck? Yeah, I'm really gonna go to a co-op now, in the middle of the DLC. Sure. <laughs>